New ambulance is now running in the Queen City. It will be permanently stationed in the new North End. Local 22's Courtney Kramer joins us live in the newsroom tonight with more on this. Courtney. There's been talks of this happening for nearly 20 years now. The key benefit here is response time. A resource that will save lives is now in service in the Queen City. Burlington firefighters say a third ambulance is something that's been long overdue. Not only is it a third ambulance, it's two more firefighters on staff 24 7 to respond to any emergency in this community. This new ambulance comes on the heels of a vote in 2020, where 78% of Burlington voters backed the plan. City leaders say demand for emergency services is up as Burlington is growing overall. We also have an aging population that has more needs need for emergency services and there has been just some change in the way that the public accesses pre-hospitalization services and so demand has gone up significantly. Mayor Moreau Weinberger says a decade ago the city averaged 7,000 fire calls each year. Today that number is more than 8,000 calls annually forcing the city to rely on neighboring stations for help. It was very obvious when we looked at 500 calls for service that we couldn't handle ourselves as a community. It was reaching the point where it was no longer mutual aid, but it was a surplanting of services. Chief Stephen Locke says the goal is to have an ambulance on arrival within four minutes of travel time. It is going to significantly reduce the reliance or the wait time or the delay for the arrival of an ambulance. It's estimated that the new ambulance will respond to more than 1,300 calls each year. Live tonight in the newsroom, Courtney Kramer, Local 22 News.